The babu ganoush I'm making today is a great recipe for all kidney patients. Very, very low in proteins, sodium and potassium, but still very flavorful and healthy snack to brighten the day. Doing? This is Catherine. Welcome to Double O Kidney. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Baba Ganoush is a grilled eggplant dip that you can serve cold with pita chips, sliced vegetables, or bread. I've adapted this recipe for the kidney patients so you can add it to your diet without any worry. Our Baba Ganoush is full of healthy ingredients. There's raw garlic, eggplant, raw olive oil. Here's the full list. Two medium-sized eggplants, about two pounds or 900 grams. Two whole fresh lemons. Two or three cloves of garlic. Two tablespoons, 30 milliliters of olive oil. A pinch of black pepper, a pinch of parsley. To make tahini, you'll need half cup or 100 grams of sesame seeds, one tablespoon or more of olive oil, and your favorite choice of bread. As you can see, this recipe is even suitable for a vegan diet. One of the ingredients is tahini, a sesame seeds paste with a consistency similar to peanut butter. You'll often find it in salad dressings and dips. Since store both sauces are often too rich in sodium and potassium, the best option for people suffering from kidney disease is to make tahini at home. Healthier and better tasting this way. Toast the raw sesame seeds for about 5 minutes on a dry pan over medium heat. Do not overdo this. Roasting seeds will make them tastier, but you can make tahini with raw seeds too. When done, let them cool on a large plate. Now we need to blend the seeds until smooth. I prefer to use a blender, but a food processor or a mortar and pestle should work too. Add olive oil to make a tahini thinner. With this blender, it will take about 10-15 to 15 minutes to get the right smoothness. For tahini than you need, you can store it in a fridge for up to a month. Put it aside. Pierce the eggplant with a knife. And grill them over a gas flame. Grill, turning regularly until soft and blackened all over. With this medium-sized eggplant, 20 minutes should be enough. You can use an oven if you prefer, but roasting over a flame will give the whole recipe a smokier, richer flavor. them every five minutes. When done, let them cool. Discard the peel of the eggplants and put the softened flesh in the blender. Don't worry if there's still some tahini residues. Add 
add one third cup of tahini. Lemon juice. The minced garlic. The black pepper. Blend until the ingredients are mixed but not more. Serve at room temperature or refrigerated. Add some olive oil and parsley. I'm having it with panic carousel to make it even more Mediterranean, but it is also really good with sliced vegetables. Don't worry if there are leftovers, Papa Ganoush is even better after a day or two in the fridge. And tell me in comments if you have tried this recipe. I can't wait to know if you like the Papa Ganoush. This is all for today. If you like this video, please like and leave a comment. Thank you for watching. Mmm.